guys, and welcome to the fourth bookmobile video. I'm Lily, and that's Janie. And today we're going to be making bagpipes. So these are the materials that you're going to see in your kit, and you're also going to have materials that you can use to make a little flute. So today we have a special guest named Tommy, and he's going to teach you guys how to make your bagpipe. Okay, these are the items to make your DIY bagpipe. You can kind of use any bag as long as there's no holes in it. So you could use like a grocery plastic bag if you have one, but those tend to get more holes in them. So you need scissors, tape, straw or straws, plastic bag, and two recorders. Um, the most successful one I had was with a larger plastic bag cut about halfway or two thirds of the way up. And then you can use the other side that you don't use for another one. You just have to tape it up. And then you grab a straw, which is your little blow pipe, and you put it at the end, a couple inches in, and then you wanna tape it secure. This is the sticky part. Then you get that down there. And you sort of tape it over and you can kind of seal up the bag a little bit too on this part. Not necessary. It's mostly to secure the straw. And then this is where your drone recorder goes. this end here but you want to make sure that this part is sticking out this little hole part don't cover that up with tape just below that little hole And then I would do another piece of tape to make sure that there isn't any air leaking through. The top. There. You can see the hole isn't covered up. And then you go to the corner for where your uh, chanter recorder is going to go. Tiny little hole. And then same thing, you don't want to cover up that hole and you put it in the corner. And then you tape that up, all nice and secure.
really fun. And now we're gonna show you how to make a flute out of straws. Okay, so you're gonna need straws, a ruler, scissors, and tape. So you're gonna start by taking all of your straws. I have eight straws right here. And so the first one is 12 centimeters. So that one's good. And then the next one we're gonna cut down to make it 11 centimeters. And then lay it right next to it. And then we're gonna repeat this process all the way for all of the rest of them. So now I cut them all, and so I'm just going to line them all up so that the tops line up, and so it kind of like is at an angle. I'm going to take my tape and just lay it flat across, and then fold in the ends. And then you're done. You can just blow into the top and it makes... You can kind of see it makes a little flute noise. So now we're all done with our flute. Thank you so much for watching our fourth sensory video and you hope we, we hope you enjoyed this week's craft. See you next time. Bye!